those point symbols that I've been talking about are basically two types. Um, typically we use the SVG um, if we go in in our church out here. Um, so this had a point pattern and down here we saw this was an SVG marker. The other possible marker is a font marker. Um, many mapping libraries give access to symbologies as fonts. So I'll probably on this computer here, I will have a lot of specialized mapping fonts. Um, so I have a lot of mesological mapping fonts here. Or I have um, military mappings, or I have different types of mapping fonts. Um, many of these come together with the uh, ESRI's ArcGIS, uh, but there's also other fonts that you can um, find. <clears throat> when we talked about our data before, and I've talked about what was in the different folders. Um, we can go down in our GIS data, so data, and uh, look in this map folder. Here. It had this diverse ordinance, and down there there's fonts. So if you install these fonts on your computer, on the Windows, you just double click on them and say install. It will install these symbols that are specific for Danish mapping. So you have all of those classical Danish map symbols available um, in different variations um, to create um, what is our classical Danish maps. So all of those can be installed and once they're installed you can pick them up uh, what are they called? KMS. Uh, I don't know if it already has loaded it. Let's see. K. Nah. Uh, we only need to uh, close the application first to see the installed uh, fonts. But we can do that. And um, we can then have character fonts installed on your computer. Um, SVG is the main one we use and um, SVG is scalable vector graphics it's um, so it's a drawing format you can create it with many programs um, typically one uses uh, Inkscape or if one has Adobe you can use um, Adobe Illustrator and these can then read and write SVG that's also um, uh, some online SVG draw it's called that you can use if you don't want to install a program on your computer. So scalable vector graphics is probably the best because it's much easier to create them than it is to do character sets but we also have a series of symbols as character sets you can choose from. 